Hello, Dr. Bill Wagoner here, Chief Dental Officer of New Smile Crowns. Today I'd like to talk to you about prepping and cementing four maxillary anterior zirconia crowns. So there are a lot of ways to do it, and I'm not saying that my way is the right way, I'm just saying it's worked really well for me, and I've done hundreds of these anterior zirconia crowns. A lot of people say, well, should I prep a central and lateral? Should I do both the centrals? How do you do it? I will start with the central. I will uh, prep one central. I will get my tri-end crown to fit just the way I want it to fit on that. I'll remove the tri-end crown. Now I try on the other central to make that prep look just like the prep that I've done. So I've done my two centrals. Get the tri-ends, make sure they're in nice alignment, make sure that the um, incisal edges match up and everything's looking good. Now I'll move on and do the laterals. Prepping one, getting it to fit, then prepping the other so that the same size crowns fit. Now I put on all four of my tri-ends, make sure that I like the alignment. Now I'm ready to cement. When I'm ready to cement, the way that I like to do it is I will cement this, the two centrals simultaneously. Got the cement in the crown, put them up on there, just let it set for 15 seconds. After 15 seconds, you can tack cure from the facial and the lingual, five to 10 seconds, uh, five seconds each. Once you've got it tack cured, you want to kind of tease away the excess uh, cement. Now, while you're teasing away the excess cement, your assistant's already filling up your, your lateral incisors. You place the laterals. Again, you let them sit for 15 seconds. Then you tack your facial lingual for five seconds. Now you gently remove the excess from around the laterals. Now you've got the excess removed. You can go back to your centrals because it's been about 60 seconds that you've just let that uh, chemical cure of the cement begin to work. Now you can go in and you can cure it for 10 to 15 seconds on the facial and the lingual on each one of those. By the time you're doing that, you're done doing that, You've waited 60 seconds on the others, on the laterals, so you can go to the laterals, finish curing those with the light, 10 to 15 seconds, facial and lingually, and now you've got everything in nice alignment, everything has been cured. Uh, the final step is to go in and clean up any excess cement, because the first time you did it, you got kind of the gross cement, but there's always gonna be some little stuff, make sure and go through interproximally with some floss with a knot tied in it because it seems like there's always some interproximal uh, cement left over and you want to make sure and get all that out. But once you've done that, you're going to have four nicely aligned crowns uh, that are well cemented and they're going to stay in place. So I hope that's helpful and I'll see you next time.